2014 Infiniti QX56. LED full install. All right, so on the Infiniti, the way to take this cover off for the top dome, got the screwdriver there. It's got four little clips. So it's got the same on both sides. So you'll put the screwdriver. There you go. And they pop right out pretty easy. Get a regular flat tip screwdriver. Pry that in there. Take it out. I'm gonna get the LED light bulb. Find out which side is the polarity that it takes. And that's it. Get that cover. Snap it back in place. All four points and you're good. Then you got the those right there. And there's the last one all the way at the back. We'll get to those in a minute. All right, so on all the doors, it's got a light like this. I'm gonna put the screwdriver there, just pry it out. Very simple. Side to side. Take it out. Disconnect this. All right, once you disconnect it, you're gonna see right here, got little clips. So you got the screwdriver. So flat tip. Screwdriver in there. And lift that out. Once you have the little cover off, see the screwdriver's there? You get the, your flat tip. Pry that little guy out. All right, once you got that LED in there, get this cover. Make sure you lighten it up. That just snaps right on. Let's see if we can do this with one hand. Yeah. There we go. Tuck the wire back inside. And you just push it right in. Really easy. Now we're gonna go to the top. This little guy on the back side. So get the screwdriver. We're gonna try it on this side. Yep. Okay, once you got that out. Get the screwdriver, pop that up. Get your LEDs, try it both sides, see it doesn't work on this side. Flip it, works on this side. Now you get the cover, stick one side in, and the other, and that's it. Okay, now we're going to this one. Same thing. Get the screwdriver right in there. Pop that up. Screwdriver. Get that bulb. Pry it out. Get another one of the 50-50 SMD wedge bulbs. All right, a lot of times when you put them in there, you gotta make sure these little wires are kind of spread out. All right, because when you stick it in there, sometimes they'll move around, won't get good contact. Make sure they're spread out good. Try it again. That side's not it. That's the side. There you go. Then uh, get that cover. Once again, get the cover, put it in that way first, and snap it in place. That's done. All right, back passenger door, screw.
screwdriver there, there. Take it out, unplug it. You unplug that. Get the screwdriver. It's it easier on this side. Just right in the little corner, pull it out, kind of hold it in there with your other finger. And you get this one. There you go. All right. You got the bulb right there. Get your screwdriver. Just pop that little guy out of there. That's it. Get your LED. You gotta plug it in first, so you know where, what to do with the LED. Plug that in. Nah. Once again, try one side, see if it works. Doesn't work on that side. Go with the other side. There you go. Same thing with this cover. Got the square part on this on the top, more round on the bottom here. Same for the cover. Right. Line that up. There you go. Put the wire back in push it right in. Now the last one we have is the trunk. Okay for the trunk you got this thing right here. So you try to always look for it. It's gonna have like a little notch somewhere around here. If you don't see one just find a place you could stick a screwdriver in there. Pop it out. No. Don't rush it. You don't want to break these things depending on the, on the, the year of the car. Some of them will break on you. So just take your time. No rush. Okay, this is a little tricky. So you see that right there? You gotta kinda pull the whole thing down and get a screwdriver inside that little hole. Push that in there and then you're able to get that part out. So you gotta do it again for the other side so pull this there we go all right so this is a different bolt all right make sure you have it off because not these things get really hot not very fun to touch when they're hot very simple a screwdriver pull it out all right so this is what we're working with all right so we could have used this one right here same size Best tone LED with the 50-50 SMDs. But since it's a trunk and it's a pretty big trunk in the infinity, we're gonna use a 12 LED. Stick this in here. Just basically like get the wire, shove it up in there. Now we got the 3M tape on the back. Alright, so we're gonna peel that off. Then what we're gonna do with this one, I just get it to stick basically on its own connector right there. All right, tucking these wires. That's just so it'll stay in place until you put the actual cover back on. All right. Once you got that in there, hold itself in place. Get this cover. And put one side in first, then the other side. And that's it. Yeah. I got a pretty bright light for the back since it's a big trunk. Put it in the middle so it turns off on its own and that's it now we're going to the trunk to the tail we're going to the license plate lights for the qx56 to get the license plate lights out i was trying through here but i couldn't find the spot to actually get it out of so i looked inside there's this little cover right here all right it's like a little emergency cover when you lock yourself in the trunk you got the little thing so you can pop it open but it goes all the way inside and in there that's the actual lights okay both of them now hopefully you have a small hand or, some, or somebody with a small hand stick your hand in there 
All right, so I tried to undo the, the light from the back. That wasn't really working out. But this thing right here, so I'm gonna unplug it so you can see what I'm talking about. All right, a little plug right there. See, it has this clip right here. When you put your hand inside the actual door, the hole right here, you can reach this piece and just press it. Just press that right there, and then from back here, you start prying open, prying open until it slides out. All right, that was the easiest way, unless you have somebody with small enough hands that could actually put them in there and twist this off, which is still kind of hard. Your best bet, stick your hand in there, push in this clip right here, and have a screwdriver out here, and then wiggle it out until it finally comes out of there. All right, so to check the bulb, to check the bulbs, you gotta turn on the lights. All right, we're using the nine LED wedge bulbs, which projects a pretty good light for the tag. All right, make sure you turn them on. That way you can see if, if it's in the right side or not. Because just like every, like most LEDs, one side will work, one side won't. So there's a positive and a negative. And you do that, put the covers back on, and pop it in. So I'll show you that right now. All right, so once you have the LEDs in there, get this guy wiggle it in there until it goes in line it up in the hole once it's in that hole it's gonna want to go inside and that's it it's in now on to the next one okay for this one was a little bit harder getting that that one there my hands are not that small so I got a screwdriver and I touched that piece right there that clip right there just touch it there then with my other hand came over here and all I really had to do was just put my finger right there pull that up and then got it out so now you just keep wedging it out keep cranking on it get your screwdriver there you go very simple not too hard just keep wiggling it until it comes out of there All right, now we're on the other side, okay? So we're gonna put this inside of here. All right. Line up the holes. Stick it inside. Once you do that, you gotta twist it. Twist that in there. And you slowly wiggle it in so it finds its hole. Yep. There you go. Oh, 